What is up, Karatics? In this video, we're going to be customizing the 2013 Viper GTS and the Crew 2. Very beautiful car. I've always loved the Viper. Pretty much love every single generation of it. I mean, just the concept of a naturally aspirated V10 with a lot of power and a very lightweight car. Just crazy. Something very uh, American about it. <laughs> so, at the time of this recording, it is July 4th. So, I found it very fitting to customize a very nice American car. I'll be uploading the Corvette a little later today also, so I'm going to do the Viper and the 2014 Corvette Stingray later today. So in the Crew 2, the Viper cost a whopping $375,000, which is quite crazy to be honest. And if you have the Gold Edition, it costs two ninety nine, dollars which is pretty much $300,000. So with the Gold Edition, the 20% discount, you save about $75,000 when you purchase this car, which is quite a bit of money. But again, like I've stated before, it's very easy to make money in this game. Not that time consuming. You can make 90 grand in about 9 minutes or so with a hypercar race. So it's really not that crazy, not that difficult to make money in this game. So let's go ahead and jump right into it. Square to customize. So we got the factory colors. I'm going to start off with that first. We got the whites. It's like candy looking red. Regular red, the yellow, gray, blue, black, and light blue. Okay, next up we're going to go into the visual parts. So we have the hoods. So you have this hood, it's like the Viper ACR hood. And this one is like from the race car. Carbon fiber. Carbon fiber down the center, that's interesting. And then the race car hood again, carbon fiber. Okay, so I'm definitely going to do the Viper ACR hood. I did purchase it already because I was kind of looking around at the customizations before the video. Um, so it is three thousand dollars for this hood okay next up we got the front bumpers so you have the carbon fiber top portion of the headlight instead of the black oh it's the whole headlight with carbon fiber okay i see and then this one gives a nice simple front splitter and carbon fiber then this one does the top part and carbon fiber with a splitter and this one gives you a splitter from the viper acr not the uh, extreme arrow because there was two arrow packages on the Viper ACR. There was a standard which looks like this, and then there was the, what they call the extreme arrow, which had double canards and uh, uh, supports for the splitter and all that. I'll throw a picture on screen so you can see the difference. But yeah, that was a completely different splitter. I mean, not completely. It, I mean, it was more extended, uh, stronger, more downforce. But you get the idea. So next up we got the carbon fiber and the headlight with that splitter. Then you have the splitter from the Viper race car. With carbon fiber there. Okay, so I'm, obviously I'm going to do the Viper ACR splitter. I like I like the simple one, the first aero pack. I think I, I like it a lot. Next up we got the wheels. So you do get all the factory wheels that Viper offers. So you have the standard ones, you have the silver ones. Actually these are the standard ones, number three. We have these. These that these come on the base viper if I'm not mistaken. The black one, so simple, and then you have the custom wheels from the game. So I mean, they pretty much give you every single viper wheel option, which I really like. Um, I already chose the Viper ACR wheel, so here it is right here. Even though it has GTS written on it, uh, oh, it's SRT. What's upside down? <laughs> All right, so this is literally the the uh, ACR wheel, so that's perfect. Next up, you have the caliper color. Definitely gonna paint those in red. So the side mirrors and carbon fiber. Not sure how I feel about that. Hmm. I kind of like I like it to flow. I feel like the mirrors further down. It's not really. Um, I kind of like the flow a little more. I'm gonna leave the standard one. Next up, we got the. You can do a carbon fiber side splitter. I mean side skirt, not <laughs> a side splitter. Or the uh, race car exhaust with the cut fender there. Um, hmm. the, the Viper ACR does not have this this carbon fiber section, but I think it looks pretty good. I think I'm gonna put it on there. Something a little different, kind of matches our front splitter. I don't know why they didn't do this on the actual Viper. But next up, we got the rear fender. So you have this. You can do this vent from the race car if you want. I don't really like the way it looks, to be honest, so... Hmm. Yeah, it doesn't look too bad. I'll just throw, throw it on there. Why not? Um, rear wing. 
So you have the Carbon Forever one. It's a standard option. Well, it's not standard. It was an option on the Viper GTS. You can get. And then you have this uh, wing from the race car. So this is not the wing from the Viper ACR. That spoiler is completely different from this one. Um, so I won't be putting that one on there. I'll be putting a short one, the carbon fiber lip. I think that looks great. You don't really need more than that. If they had the Viper ACR spoiler, I would have put it, but they don't have it, unfortunately. So next up, you can... Um, so standard is black. It was portion around the lights. And then you can do it colored with the carbon fiber, like the Viper ACR. And then you have the race car diffuser. Colored, carbon. Actually, this is the race car diffuser. This is a different one. Okay, this is the race car diffuser right here. All right, that's all the options there. Um, the Viper ACR diffuser <laughs> definitely is not that large. That's just over exaggerated. That sticks out way too far. That's ridiculous. That's too much. Uh, I'm just gonna do the carbon fiber there. Okay. Interior color. I'm gonna do a red. So I'm gonna show you all the colors first. We go. All right. I'm gonna do the red. So your style. Very cool. And then simple red stitching. So I think I'm gonna do the um, the second one. I like that one a lot. Not too much red, but just enough. And then you can choose the. Uh, Leather or the suede. So I'm gonna do the suede to match the ACR. And then interior insert, you're gonna do the carbon fiber all over the whole interior. AC vents, everything the handle. Really, really cool. Or the black. So I'm gonna do the carbon fiber. Very nice. So that's all the options there. So next thing I'm gonna do, that looks really good. <laughs> So the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to paint it white, then I'm going to go to liveries, then I'm going to go to top 100 liveries that people have created in the community. And here we go. We've got the Viper ACR livery somebody created already. We just hit download, $3,000. And if you go over here to my livery and you hold square, which is hold remove, you see it going there in the bottom, it actually refunds you the money and it takes away the livery, which is really cool. All right, so now we got that all finished. So now I'm gonna take it for a quick drive just to show you that it's 100% stock. There's a the proof right there, 100% stock. All right, so let's take it for a quick drive so I can give you guys my opinion on the way it sounds, the way it drives, and then we're gonna take it for a nice top speed run. All right, here we go. Very, very nice, see the gate in here. Did a pretty good job with the engine sound, it's pretty much spot on. Those backfires, oh my gosh. Every time I hear it makes me laugh. Very, very fast for a stock car. You know, unbelievable how fast it is for being a stock car. Back of a Viper. Alright. Here we go. So again, 100% stock. I'm going to do a top speed run. I'm going to use a nitrous at the very, very end so that I can get the top speed up a little higher. Alright, here we go. Very, very nice car. I like the way it came out. 
Unfortunately, you can't just do suede on the dash. You have to do it on the whole interior, so the, the seats are full of suede. I might put it back to leather in the future, but... Yeah, it doesn't look too bad with the red calipers, the Viper ACR stripe. It's a very subtle build. It's not It's not an ACR, it's not a GTS. It's like somewhere in between. Kind of like something you made on your own, which I think looks really good. Alright guys, that was a customization, a little review of the top speed run of the 2013 Viper GTS and the Crew 2. Hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching, and here are all the wheel options from the game if you haven't seen them already.